So a lot of possible plot leaks have been coming out about Deadpool 3 recently, and I'm going to touch on a few of them here just to keep you updated. And if any of these do come out to be true, this is your spoiler warning, just in case. Now, according to all the information that's going out there right now, this film is going to follow up right after the events of Deadpool 2. We're going to be seeing the TVA from the Loki TV series pick up Wade Wilson after all of his time traveling shenanigans at the end of the second film. And we're going to be seeing Owen Wilson's character Mobius returning, traveling with Wade Wilson to an alternate universe to help prune that timeline. Apparently, this is going to be an alternate version of the Fox X-Men universe that we've been watching, but not the first class, we're going to be going to the original characters. And the film apparently is going to be revolving around Magneto, who is going to be leading a version of the X-Men in this film, who has taken out all of the other superheroes in that universe. Apparently, he's even going to be wielding Mjolnir, Thor's hammer, which is nuts and something that I would love to see, considering he has manipulation of metal, and it is made of Uru. So, you know, even though it was made in the heart of a dying star, apparently Magneto is going to be able to use it with his powers, which I actually personally think that is pretty cool because I love seeing other characters use famous weapons, like when Cap used Mjolnir or even when Vision used it in Age of Ultron. I mean, he picked it up, but you know, same thing. And while he's in that universe, he's going to be teaming up with that universe's version of Hugh Jackman's Wolverine. And I really hope that he has the classic yellow costume. Or even the yellow and brown one from the Frank Miller run. I think that would be pretty cool too, but nothing hits harder than the classic 90s yellow and blue. And I know it wouldn't be practical, but I would love to see the over-the-top fins coming off the side, like pictured right here. That would be amazing. And we already know that this film is going to be rated R, so I am fully on board for this film. As more plot leaks come out, I'll be making videos about it, so stay tuned. Go ahead and leave a like on this video if you enjoy these plot leaks and want to see more. Leave a comment with how you think about these leaks. Are you excited to see Magneto return? And by the way, it's Ian McKellen. Don't forget to subscribe and check out the links in the description to support the channel. Thanks so much for watching and you have a great day. I'll catch you in the next one.